Now let's get started with train test split. For that, let's import pandas to import our data set. Oops. Now let's read our data set that is pd.readcsv. And inside of this, we can just mention the data set name that is titanic dataset.csv. That is the format of it. Let's set data. This is our data. Now, please note one thing that in this tutorial, we are not going to clean our data as the, as the agenda behind this is to just look into how to split our data set. So you can see that there are some missing values in age and fair. So we just keep it as it is and we will just try to split the data set. So let's check the data dot columns. So what we are going to do is we are going to take all these features till cabin okay, as X and Y as embark. That is the label. Okay, you have to check data dot head. So we are going to take all of these columns till cabin and all of these will be X and embark will be our label that is QS, QS and some more values. Okay, so in this, what we exactly are doing is from all the X, we are going to predict Y, Y will be embark. Okay, again, this is some sort of a classification problem. So let's take X is equal to data dot I log, I log is a function of pandas. And inside of this in square brackets, we have to mention that we need all the rows so it just tells that we need all the rows and over here we have to mention which all columns we need. So from starting we need all the columns till the last one. So you can see that we don't have embarked over here. So the same thing for y. y is equal to let's take this y is equal to data dot i log inside of this we need all the rows and we need the last one. So if I check Y now, we have the last column. So X has all the features and Y is the labels which we have to predict out. Now we have X and Y. Now what we need to do is we need to split the data set. For that, we have our module in SQLite library itself. So let's import it from dot model selection import train test split let's check if everything is fine so everything is just fine and what we are going to do is rather than writing everything i'm just going to write the function name brackets as this is a function and then inside of this i'm going to press shift plus tab it will give me a small description about the function. So it splits the arrays or matrices into a random train and test subsets. And we have to pass X and Y inside of this. Apart from that, what it will return me back is this. It will return me X train, X test, Y train, Y test. Let's copy this out, paste it here. And over here, inside of this, we have to mention X and Y. That is our training data and our labels. Apart from this, we also need to mention the test size. So I'm going to take 0 0.2 as this is an 80 20 ratio division. So if I check now X train, you can see there are some 3 to 4 columns. Same thing, we can just check out Y train. 334 columns so these are from which our model will be trained and now y x test and y test 84 rows 84 rows from this our model will be evaluated so that's how we split our data set into training set and test set that's it for this video. In our next video, we are going to start with linear regression.